Okay, is this some kind of sick joke? Because I always end up feeling sorry for Robo, no matter what the context. It doesn't matter if it's story, if it's gameplay, if it's anything. I want to direct you to the fact that he still is the only one who does not have 99999 for his HP and MP. It's... Like, I love you, bud. I really do. Come in, bring it in. I... Okay, now it just looks like I'm making out with the guy, but... Seriously, I don't know if somebody was like robophobic or what. Anyway, hey everybody, it's Chugga Conroy. Welcome back to more Chrono Trigger. Uh, last time we had a most unfun time in the Lost Sanctum, and this time the unfunness is yet to conclude. It's my lifelong dream to build a great bridge to span the mountains. Unfortunately, I have no luck acquiring the tools I'd need for such task. To build the frame, I need sturdy lumber. To reinforce the structure, I need strong metal. To nail it all together, I'll need a durable hammer. If you haven't come across anything I could use, would you bring it to me? You'd be enormously helpful. Yeah, we'll look for builder's materials. All right, so we gotta bring him each of these three things, and I guess now we're just gonna go off and look. Because the designer was a noob, you gotta go to prehistory because talking to every single NPC in the Middle Ages yields no- Land the plane! Where do you- what do you want me to be? Oh, okay, fine. I, I was mashing A on every square conceivable and it just was not doing it. This is not off to a good start if I'm already complaining this much. Uh, I swear I will try to keep it together. I've already said a lot of my grievances with this. I think you get it by this point. Lumber, eh? Try my friend in the Millennia Wood. He might be able to help. Hey, what do you know? For once he's actually right next to the entrance and not all the way on the very last conceivable square. There used to be an enormous tree growing in this wood, but those monsters fell, but this sounds awfully familiar. What a waste, it was such a strong and stalwart tree. You need lumber to build a bridge? Well, I'd much rather see that tree used than let it go to waste. Wait right here, I'll saw some wood for you. Here you go, I'm sure it will serve well. I can appreciate a man who is so enthusiastic about his wood. Obtain the god wood, no less. What? You need to borrow the golden hammer. All right, I'm not using it at the moment, and I did receive it from you after all. Here you go. I can appreciate a man who wants a giant hammer just to stare at it all day. Looking for some metal, you say? Ooh, I almost passed you up. I once had a lump of steel in a box within the cave to the west. It was too heavy for me to carry all the way back here. I can't promise it's still there, but it's worth a look. We're back in the Middle Ages, by the way. You wouldn't know it from just looking at these caves, but uh, yeah, we are in that version of this era. So two of them were in one era, one is in the last. Oh good, I was getting nostalgic for killing this rat over and over again. The purpose of the mysterious cave of nothingness that I passed up has at last been revealed. This looks like some kind of beak-nosed magician who's holding up his hands and he's got a sorcerer's cloak hanging off of him and also, it has boobs, so never mind, it's not a him. <laughs> I, I don't know, I just love interpreting wall sprites because they have to reuse assets so frequently. Uh, oh! Anytime you want to wake up, there there you go. You're always the slow guy who uh, never gets up on time with the other ones. Uh, we'll call you Clyde. Uh, these are black bats. They're able to inflict sleep, and they're pretty weak to magic. If I'm not mistaken, magic should just clear them out just fine. Uh, Robo, give them an electrocute! just could have used Luminaire cheaper and more effectively, but I wanted him to feel special, okay? This is all about Robo. I just, I need him to feel good about himself because he never gets anything. <laughs> ah, well, okay, you guys can just kind of, uh, what were you? You're like fondling the wall? Uh, okay, I can't let that slide. Yeah, I caught you, what now? Robo's hitting for 1596 without us having to worry about him having exactly uh, a nine in the last place value of his HP. This weapon's working out pretty well. I think I'm gonna stick with it. All that goes down, and then we can go further into the depths of the ca Ooh, uh, we've already fought you. Haven't met any new enemies so far. Uh, it's like he's some kind of sacred deity to what, whoever lives here because he's up on this pedestal and the bats are just, uh, but lowly subjects of his. We never got to see it, but the bats are meant to counter you with sleep. Not like it matters because you totally have immunity to all debuffs at this point, and if you don't, 
What's wrong with you? Uh, get a steel ingot from that chest. We technically don't need to investigate any further. There is this compartment down here, though, and another one on the other side. Which, yep, we can weasel our way in there. Get a turbo ether. And then over this way, yes, last chest contains a lapis, or the first chest if you are more diligent than I. This rat's favorite hobby is getting murdered, isn't it? Chrono got a level up, meaning Robo is even further behind now. <laughs> trying to make you feel good, and now I'm just making you feel even worse by trying to include you in stuff forcibly when you're feeling down. I do that a lot when I'm trying to cheer people up. All right, ah, uh, that god wood should do nicely for the lumber. Dear me, that golden hammer is glorious. That should serve splendidly. Oh, I ought to be able to use that steel ingot for the metal I need. My thanks, with all this, I should be able to make the bridge of my dreams a reality. Here, take this as a token of my gratitude. Oh, I know what this one is and I've been looking forward to it. It's a haste helm, another one of these things. This is another quest that isn't that bad. If you know what to do, it's over very quickly. It's not at all a pain. It's worth another haste help. Off to the mountains he goes. I hope you're good at yodeling because that's a requirement for working up in the mountains, sir. Don't let me down. I see you walking away slowly, unsure of yourself. I'll be checking on you. Right now, in fact. I'd ask if you come here often, but I already know the answer to that. Robo got that level up that he so desperately needed but not 99 MP. Up on top of the mountain. Don't tell me. I wasn't supposed to go. We really must stop meeting like this. That neighbor of mine loves to build things almost as much as he loves to tell me about it. Yeah, hasn't he anyone else to bother all day? Okay. I am mad. I came back to town, and I talked to this reptite, and they told me nothing. It was only after I went back to prehistory, talked to everyone there, and came back that they would actually start telling me about this. My neighbor has been working hard building that bridge, but lately he hasn't even been coming home. I don't suppose you could go make sure he's all right, could you? It's not like him to be gone for this long. He always used to return at night. Silly me for thinking I could just follow the guy up the mountain and he would be there. Silly me for thinking this game would behave like Chrono Trigger. Cause you know, it's Chrono Trigger. Well crap, this repeated battle is just my own fault. You ever get tired of dying so much, or does the radiation that turned you green just kind of make you not feel anything anymore? You need something, I help you. I be your friend. Have you encountered a man attempting to construct a bridge upon this mountain? I see him. He built bridge alone just past here. There is a high probability that man that you saw is who we seek. Will you allow us to pass? Okay. I don't know if this sounds so menacing with everything that you say. Especially being our friend. I would very much appreciate it if you didn't do that. Okay, new area at last that he conveniently fell asleep in front of all that time ago. And by all that time ago, I mean the very last time. <laughs> Reused assets? What is this weak ass? What is this? Yeah, I'm sure he built this out of a log and an iron ink. Uh, I guess he's in trouble or something. Brave heroes, help! Yeah, there's the yodeling. My thanks, I fear I'd not have survived much longer. I've been toiling away at this bridge, but the work takes a great deal out of a man. Seems I grew a tad careless and lost my footing. If only someone with more had someone with more brawn to assist me. It it'll be some time before I finish at this rate. New possesses a great stra great strength and endurance. Why don't we ask that new? You have an idea of someone who could help? My pardons, but it would be most gracious if you could uh, inquire on my behalf. You know, uh, it would be re it would actually be like 
I was gonna say it'd be logistically impossible for him to have not seen the new to be able to get here, but uh, it's this part of the game. We have a request for you. Will you be? Would you be willing to assist in the construction of a bridge? Yes, I try. I want help you. This is the assistant of whom you spoke? Sure is, don't judge a book by its cover. He's a strong one. I, I see, well, I suppose if you say so. It all right, I strong. Well then, haste makes waste. First things first. They didn't have an apostrophe under things, so it didn't first thing is first, it was incorrect. I hope I'm right on that and that I'm not incorrect on grammar yet again like I always am. You weren't so bad at all. No, I not bad at all. All right, next we need to. What's the matter, New? Hungry, can't move, need food. Get away from his mouth, get away from his mouth. Oh dear, this is a problem. Please, I beg you, bring this new something to eat. Why do we not ask the villager if there is something that we might, somewhere we might obtain food? Oh, you know where they might be able to get some food? Wonderful, I'll wait here with him. I just love how they teleport you for convenience one screen away, but they won't teleport you down the mountain. You keep reincarnating to fart on us. Is that the meaning of life? He's well then, that's a relief. If you see him again, be sure to give him my best wishes. I can't eat your best wishes. Oh dear, he's hungry. Well then, will you give him this for me? Obtain a hearty lunch! Fellow's been around for a very long time. I don't know if my cooking will be anything like what he's used to, but I hope he enjoys it. You're kind of seeing the problem here. You can't possibly be efficient and talk to all these different guys all in a row to like get everything that you need. There's no way to really chain these objectives together. You just have to do them one at a time and they all involve walking to the end of a dungeon and then back again with no method of fast travel. Yeah, what he said. Dramatic music together with this visual. <laughs> this is so stupid. <laughs> yeah, go ahead, throw it in. This music is literally ruined forever. <laughs> On future playthroughs, whenever I get to the trial scene, I'm just gonna think of this. Oh, she made this. I feel strong now. I work hard again. Can I ask favor? Why not? <laughs> what? I get hungry, I can't work. I want you bring me food. Old monster have good food. Long, long time ago. Sweet yellow thing. I like that food. All right, you just keep working on the bridge. I'll watch over this new. Please hurry back if you can. You're not gonna teleport us to the foot of the mountain, are you? Uh. I know that contrary to what the angry Twitters will tell you, reusing visual assets and especially animations are standard practice in game development because it's very, very expensive, but this is just a freaking joke. I forgot it was like this because I hadn't seen this in years and it made me laugh when I saw they were seriously reusing this scene for this. It does not even remotely fit. I get that when artwork and animations are serviceable, it doesn't make sense to just make new ones for the sake of making new ones. But, yeesh. Oh, rat, you're reused assets, but at least you didn't make me laugh. The only direction given is monsters in prehistory. Inside of the Great Southern Swamp. Well, there's this frog. You're a yellow thing. Do you happen to taste sweet? You guys are licking yourselves all day with your tongue dripping out of your mouth, so you would know. It's in the upper right corner, right around here. Yes, it's the Death Creeper. That's what we need to fight. And uh, yeah, we could Luminaire take you out quickly, or you could do water too before we have the chance. Oh, it's fine, we're taking seven damage. I sort of like how the party's standing right here. It actually looks kind of cool with them all standing in a triangle like that, and how they're just kind of looking to the side. Maybe it's rule of thirds or something, but yeah, they look pretty good is what I'm trying to say. All right, so we'll go ahead and shoot you in the tongue, give you a nice piercing, and there we go. Look. Obtain sweet banana. 
That looks tasty enough. I wonder if the if that's the what the food the new wanted. You're still startled by my presence? I thought we were on first name basis, Dyer. You had better not want another banana, cause I picked that swamp clean and there was only one growing in it. I know that it's your birthplace and it makes sense for you to want food from all that time ago, cause we all get nostalgic once in a while, but just take it, we have brought food. Thank you. Yes, this is this is sweet yellow food. Now I can work. You wait. I build bridge. The bridge is almost finished now, thanks to all his help. You should check back from time to time and watch how things are coming along. All right. Well, nothing more we can do here. You won't believe what he said to me. I climbed all the way up the mountain to give him a banana, and he told me I went all that way for nothing. At least I can get high off your gases and forget it all. So the guy in the Middle Ages tells you to go off and do some other things while he works on the bridge. These things are in prehistory. Through the narrow passage to the west is a cavern, darkest pitch. Beyond that, well, who could know? The place is so dark you cannot see a thing. But I think something's, something's hit, there's something hidden there. You need something that will shine in the darkness? Well, the Prisma Stone is said to absorb light. Perhaps if you left a stone like that in the sun on some high peak for a long time, it would absorb enough light to shine on its very own. He's well then, that's a relief. If you see him again, be sure to give him my best wishes. That's your reward for uh, feeding the new, by the way. I can't eat your best wishes! Thrasha! Robo got a level up! Still no 99 MP. Place the Saint Stone down at the top of the mountain after climbing up it again so that you can climb back down it to go forward in time to climb up it again to retrieve it to climb down it again! Oh, rats. Froggy, I want you to know that you will give birth to someone whose children's 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 children will carry on living life as you saw fit. Your family traditions aren't going anywhere. <sighs> you, you just get stuck in this for so long, you start making up little stories about every single little regular enemy. Oh, hey, look, there's the thing on the wall again. It hasn't changed in 65 million years, good to know. So we go back into this cave in prehistory this time, which counts as an entirely different cave. Enemies haven't changed though. I, oh gosh, it's really starting to get to me, having to play through this so much. Like, I have stories about the Lost Sanctum. You have to consider my perspective. When I first played Chrono Trigger, it was the DS version, so I didn't know that this was something that was added later. I just thought this was another endgame quest like all the other ones, and I wasn't really aware that they added new areas for the DS release. So, no lie. For years after I'd played Chrono Trigger for the first time, my opinion of it was, yeah, it was a really great game, except it lost itself right at the very end. Do not play the end game quests, they are terrible. And like, yeah, the other ones are really good. Ooh, Reptite CR, that's new. That is a female only headgear piece that raises magic by five. I won't need that soon, given that she's close to star star on magic. Eh, we could put it on her. So yeah, consider my perspective that not only that did I, you know, did I think that it was just absolutely terrible in the end game? Yeah, those other side quests were great. I have always believed that, always thought they were great, great side quests. The problem is that think about how short those are. The end game side quests that are actually good take two hours. This on its own, I've been at it for, I think about three and a half at this point and it's still going. My visual sensors do not function in total darkness. We should go back. Wait, what? I... I have the stone! I will show you! I have... Yeah, the waystone! Doesn't have an item description, unfortunately, but... Let me guess, even though I've already talked to an NPC who tells me that I'm gonna need that rock to see here, I didn't talk to them again after picking it up, so it doesn't work. 
I swear to the sweet mother of Magus, if the person I have to talk to, thank God. I was about to say, if the person I have to talk to is in the Middle Ages for no reason. Shines like the sun. With that, you should be able to find your way even in the deepest darkness. Won't you go see what lies in that dark and cave beyond the Great Southern Swamp? Yeah, I agree to explore the cave. Freaking Hawkeye did not have these problems. Hawkeye even made its way back into your inventory. Pooh had it. Anyway, I wasn't actually done. So my opinion at first was that Chrono Trigger had a really terrible end game, and it was otherwise a fantastic game, just don't play the end game quests. When I found out that this was a new area, the way I found out was somebody telling me that they added new content in the DS version, and I said, let me guess, it's the Lost Sanctum and it's terrible, and they actually just went, yep. And I didn't even have to look it up, I just knew. I really should have known better that light is powered by talking about it. Okay, at least it had the de common decency to look cool. Wow, that was amazing! There's a path ahead! Let's go! <laughs> You're the only one excited about this, Luca. <laughs> I am so glad I no longer call you my favorite character. Okay, no. I'm just- I'm sorry I'm losing. I really am. It's- this place has hurt me on a deep and personal level. Just so, so hard. <laughs> at least I have 604,000 gold. I can at least take solace in knowing that I am rich. Approaching entities detected. Please take cover. I hear there are reptiles living nearby. <laughs> Finally, some good. Oh, I can't wait to sink my teeth into her. Don't be so hasty. <laughs> we gotta wait for the boss. Then it's feeding time. Hey, who's hiding down there? Yeah, sure, just come out. That'll help you. These are Metal Gear Solid, the Twin Snakes. There's three of them. They have the ability to breathe fire, a fire attack on the entire party, that is, making them actually kind of strong. Uh, double bomb? Uh, no, that's proximity based around Robo, so uh, if they survive this, we could go for a ring of fire, maybe. They won't. Nope. Inconsequential to the last. If only they didn't have us fighting so many rats every single time we went out to do anything, maybe we would actually be a decent level for this stuff. This is an emergency! We must inform the villagers! Intruders! Can I not go get- <laughs> You want me back for that when there's items within view of me! You want me back at the most inconvenient time possible! After making me climb that mountain and climb back down it like 19 times so f Okay, okay. Yeah, well, uh, they're planning to kill you, sure. Oh no, we have to call everyone together! This is grave news indeed! We cannot stand against that horde! Oh no, three snakes that are already dead? How will we ever do it? Leave it to us. You do that? I certainly cannot protest, but to speak frankly, you stand to gain nothing by helping us, you know. I'm sure you will pull some strong overpowered equipment out of your ass. I will bet my life on it. Against enemies that are inconsequential and that I will beat in one turn. We are friends, are we not? It is quite normal to fight on behalf of one's friends. Truly, you consider us friends? Oh my god, Robo's preciousness isn't even reaching me anymore. I'm so far gone. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? What did I tell you? I didn't even know that was going to happen. I just predicted it. I don't remember exactly how the sequence of events goes. I just kind of roughly do because, big surprise, I only ever had the patience to play through this once. Okay, Magus, you got a new weapon. Something I didn't think we would see for a little longer. The Doom Scythe. Attack power grows as allies are KO'd. We've seen this effect before, where it doubles if one ally is knocked out, triples if three of them are knocked out, making his regular attack very potent in parties that are, well, dead. J 
Gee, it, uh, it's kind of depressing that seeing me dead makes you able to... Well, actually, no, that's kind of sweet that seeing me dead would make him fight harder. I was about to say that you consider it such a good thing that I'm dead that you actually perform better with it, though, but no. Maggie, I, I, I will never call you that again. Testing out that new piece of equipment, it's pretty disappointing. Only hits for 810 damage. Anyway, we have our next objective. It's gonna be a long one. Next time on Chrono Trigger, we find out if Purgatory has an end. See you guys then.